Hey guys, welcome to the channel, Rockin' the Country. I'm Don, as many of you know. I decided just two nights ago, the idea struck me about, I love some of your screen names, right? And some of them, I can't figure out, like where could they even in God's name possibly come from, you know? But that's the nature of screen names. Some of your screen names are your actual names. And, uh, oops, I just dropped my little list here. And, um, but I was like, you know, after a year now, it's been just over a year since the channel launched, like a year and a month or so. And uh, I'm like, I'm going to go on like a, a subscriber screen name tangent. And uh, I'm assuming most of you are subscribers. Actually, I don't even know if you have to be a subscriber to leave a comment. But nonetheless, doesn't matter. I see the comments and the screen names leave an impression, as do some of you. And uh, so I'm going to go with... Um, just giving you my comments on some of your screen names and how they make me feel, you know, like, or what they make me think when I see them. So in no particular order, uh, I'm going to, all right, Donna Marie Zoniak. Pretty sure that's how you would say your last name. Donna Marie is such a gorgeous name. Like flat out, I just, and probably in La, uh, Italian or Spanish, it probably means like mother... Beautiful mother, I don't, something, maybe you could even tell us, but it's, I love, I love your name. I love just seeing it. It just has a certain airy fluidity to it. It's gorgeous. Um, and, oh, I'm going to save this one for last because it might be mine and some of your favorites as well. Um, Blue Sky, B-L-E-U-S-K-Y. I don't know what it is. I mean, you, you spelled blue differently, like the French spelling and uh like cordon bleu and but it's just beautiful like and blue sky is one of my favorite songs of all time by the allman brothers but it's just a beautiful like variation on it so anytime i see the name i just picture these beautiful blue skies so that's my thought on your screen name bs detector <laughs> and you know this because i've told you it in the comments but Bullshit detector, I don't know, BS detector. I just love that. Just straight shooting, here I am. Don't, don't bullshit me. But um, I don't know. I, I, it's, all, it's different. It's different, and I appreciate that. Whenever I see it, I start to crack up, actually. Um, all right, here's one. No idea where it comes from, but is that what empty means? All right, my dog, that's, <laughs> I don't know where that came from. Uh, sometimes we'll do a screen, I've done screen names before in different sites where I'm like, yeah, I don't put any thought into it. And, um, but you clearly did, you know, I think. So is that what empty means? What a screen name. There you go. Uh, let's see. Oh, Mark Pauly. You just started showing up in the comments recently and you're not a prolific poster. But uh, I don't know if you're aware of this because I don't know where you're from, but whenever we see up here in Jersey and New York and around here, whenever in Northeast, when we see the name Pauly, we, you know, I think of the mob <laughs> because that's kind of how we talk. Like, you know, hey, Pauly, you know, like that, right? Not, I mean, we don't all talk like that, but we're familiar enough with it up here. But anytime I see your name, I, I think of that. Hey, Pauly, you fit right in up here. Trenton W., all right. The reason I think the reason your name stands out to me is because Trenton is the state capital of New Jersey. I did my internship at the Ethics Commission in Trenton, and uh, which was a joke, and uh, as I learned. Um, but in any case, whenever I see that, I'm like, I don't know where you got your name from, but uh, that's what I think of. I think, oh, Trenton. There you go. That's like a Jersey thing. And uh, Daisy Clifton, I two things about your name. Daisy, of course, is just beautiful. You know, the floral, you know, just daisies type thing. But Clifton is right around the corner from me within a half hour. Clifton, New Jersey. So uh, you guys are more tied to New Jersey than you might think now that I am realizing it. Um, now, I think you would say it uh, Charlie, but it might be Charlie or Charlay. Uh, Buell, that's your screen name, but you spell your first name C-H-A-R-L-E-I-G-H, -E and I just think that's beautiful. That's just a beautiful variation 
on, um, you know, there's Charlene, there's Charlie, you know, for guys, there's Charles and all that. But is it Charlay, Charlie? It's a very pretty spelling and a very pretty name. Oh, oh, Tanya Blaylock. I don't think you would say it, Tanya. I think you would say it, Tanya. And like Tanya Tucker. And um, I, I don't know, a few years ago, I always thought it was Tanya Tucker, you know, because that's how we would, most of us would pronounce that name Tanya, even though it's with an A, it's regional or cultural or whatever. Oh, and, um, but Tanya Blaylock, every time I see your name, I just smile. Plus, you're very funny and, uh, and, um, and insightful, and you just are all of that, <laughs> as you know. Oh, James Georgia Pimp Daddy. <laughs> I see that screen name, and I'm just like, oh, my God. Sometimes I love the human race, just the stuff we do to make it through in our time. That name is hilarious. Like James Georgia Pimp Daddy. <laughs> um, oh, here's one. K capital K, lowercase c, space, capital C. KCC. And I'm not quite sure what that means, but every time it stands out, I see it. Um, there's another one whose initials um, there are DB and like uh, defensive back, you know, if you play football, but just the initials DB. And um, my friend, my, one of my dearest friends in the whole world, she knows me as well as anybody. Um, she has always called me DB for Danny boy, but it's Donnie boy and uh, from the song. And she's just always called me DB. So when you started posting, I'm like, and I'm calling you DB, it felt weird. <laughs> so, as you know, because I told you that. But anyway, I go with it because that's your screen name, DB. Uh, oh, talk to Fairbanks. The number two is in there, just like in my channel's name, Rockin' Two Country. But talk to Fairbanks. Is, is that like Fairbanks, Alaska? But then there's the talk. You know, I, I don't know. Is that like, are you a life coach? Do people talk, you know, are you talk to you to help them with, you know, life? I don't know. Um, but this is what I think of. Gan Grandma's Gone Gaming. G3, I call you that. But you've posted a lot. And I love that alliteration. Grandma's Gone Gaming. Where do you go gaming? Do you go to like casinos to go gaming? I don't know. But grandma's gone gaming, like, see ya. <laughs> I love that. Oh, this one's very pretty. Uh, Sarah Emily. And it, I didn't even know how to pronounce it at first. So as you know, I had to request, like, in the comments, like, how do you say that? Like, but it, you said it was like a combination of, like, what is it, like, your grandmother's name or, or, you know, that kind of thing, like, within the family. So it was a combination of, like, Sarah and Emily. And it's like Sarah Emily, and it's very pretty. I like that, um, and it's different. And I also like that. Um, I want to give a special shout out to the Emsweilers at this point too. Even though your screen names don't, you know, connote anything, but Christine and David, you guys are funny <laughs> and, and smart. And um, I don't know. It's just you're just, you know, David. You just bring it. You say it. You talk about it. You come at it. Christine, there's a special place for you in heaven, as we know. <laughs> and I don't think David would argue with that either. I'm guessing he would have zero argument with that. And, and I mean that in a, a good-hearted way. I think you could tell that. But, um, yeah, it's uh, get to know people through the channel. Christine, you know, your job, you know, uh, cl the hospital closed down that year. And then, and then within a month, you had another one because... That's just who you are. I knew it would work out for you. I just had that. I had a real good, strong feeling, put it that way. And it did. So, um, so anyway, but the final name, and this is like a lot of, a few folks have said, oh my God, I've always wanted that name for this, that, or the other thing. But Tupelo Honey, ah, how do you do better than that? I mean... I, it just Tupelo Honey, just absolute gorgeous name, what it represents. Um, it's been, I think Miranda has a song where she talks about Tupelo Honey. And uh, I don't know a whole lot about the derivation of not just your screen name, but the name itself. But I know it's a popular uh, expression or idiom or something. 
um, or, uh, you know, uh, in the south, you know, not up here, of course. But um, I love it. So there it goes. I just wanted to do that because it was fun. I don't even know when I'll post this and on which day, but I got the idea and I'm like, I got to go just do this. And maybe I'll do another one in a few months as you guys continue to impress me, crack me up, challenge me, uh, enlighten me, bring the 411, bring the intel, uh, you know, request songs, da 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 da, all that stuff. It's fun. So there it is. All right, guys, you're clearly rocking the country because you're here. <laughs> and uh, But keep doing it. Keep rocking the country. All right, I'll see you on another video, guys. Have a great day. Have a great day. <laughs> mm -hmm.